Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Dr. George McDermott. I'm a state certified phlebotomist, which means I'm a blood doctor. As my kids jokingly call me, they call me sometimes Count Dracula. But what we're going to be talking about today is just as serious as being under the fangs of Count Dracula. And that uh, nemesis, that epidemic that is overtaking America, is called acidosis. Acidosis is too much blood acid in your blood system. And it is measured by pH. And pH is a scale which only measures water, H2O. It's a scale that goes and starts off from zero and it ends at 14. Right here at seven is pure rainwater. <clears throat> from zero to seven is acid. From seven to 14 is alkaline. The human body was designed by God to be 7.365. Very easy to remember, seven days a week, 365 days a year, you need to be alkaline. For your sake and for your family's sake and for your grandchildren's sake, they all must be alkaline to enjoy the fruits of their life. Americans, the majority of Americans are here at 6.8, okay? And they are suffering from a condition called acidosis. Acidosis is a medical term and it very simply means that you have too much blood acid. This is caused by five different reasons. Number one is the diet that we're eating. Americans eat too much fast foods. We have too many hamburgers, french fries, and of course Coca-Cola is absolutely the worst thing you can drink. The second reason why people have acidosis is because of stress. Stress is killing Americans. The third reason is, is because of too many parasites. The fourth reason is because of uh, drugs. And I'm talking about um, over-the-counter medications. I'm talking about um, aspirin, um, uh, acetophetamine, which is also called Tylenol, we're also talking about Aleve. All these medications have too much acid and too many Americans are doing this. All four of these things we can control, but the one thing that we cannot control and the thing that is very important is the age. Because the older we get, the more acidic we're going to become and this is going to destroy the quality of your life. The human body goes through three stages of life. From the time you're born to the time you're 25, you're in what's called an anabolic stage. Okay, this anabolic stage is a Greek word which simply means that you're growing. When you are born, you are 7.7 .7 on the pH scale. You start off at 7.7. .7. From 25 to 45, you are in what's called homeostasis. At this period, you are 7.0. This is a balancing act. That's what homeostasis means. Starting off at 45, very slowly, but you become more and more acidic. This situation medically is called catabolic. Catabolic is the opposite of anabolic. Catabolic is a Greek word which basically means you're falling apart. All right, now, the problem is, is when you get to 6.4 on this pH scale, which is out here, you die, okay? So this is a lifeline right here. You start off at 7.7, .7, the middle of your life you're about seven, and as you start to become older and older, you become more and more acidic, and when you reach 6.4, you're shriveled up and basically you die. So it's very, very critically important that you understand this acidosis because what's happening is, is your body is moving this way. By drinking alkaline water, you will be able to replenish the vital nutrients into your body and you will be able to remain more and more alkaline and therefore adjust your life so you will be able to live this way. Okay, this is not only important for yourself, it's important for your children and important for your grandchildren. Everybody needs to participate in this. And the easiest method of doing this is simply just drinking a glass of water, eight glasses of water a day. By doing that, you are naturally restoring the alkalinity into your bloodstream and you're keeping away from the ravages of chronic disease. Chronic diseases are the diseases which are built up by too much acid waste in your body. These diseases very simply are cancer, diabetes, heart disease, arthritis, and the list goes on and on and on. This is the major diseases which kill Americans it is all based on acidosis, too much acid in the bloodstream. If you want to preserve your family, if you want to give your family the quality of life that they deserve, not only for yourself, but also for your children and your grandchildren, you must remain alkaline. 
It gives you the vitality. Young children have to be alkaline in order to grow. In order to have a mentally uh, alert mind, you have to be alkaline. And that's the reason why it's so critically important for you to alkalize your body all the time by drinking alkaline water.